I'm going to walk you through hanging a piggyback medication. You'll notice I've got my primary medication hanging lower than my secondary. You'll also notice that I have only one set of secondary tubing, and that is um, to prevent the need to reconnect and disconnect in between different secondary infusions, which helps prevent the risk for bloodstream infections. So when I'm ready to hang my second antibiotic or whatever piggyback you have, um, I'm going to take it off and actually drop it down below the level of the primary. This allows the bag to flush, and so we don't have to worry about the compatibility between secondary medications. You'll let it run all the way through um, until your chamber is about half full. You can squeeze it a few times into the old medication bag. And then you will put the roller clamp down. I can go ahead and throw away my old bag and spike my new bag. Hang it back up and pull the chamber. Make sure my roller clamp is unclamped and then I would